bed of sleep. Worrying about the way things might have been. You gonna bunker me to death? Yep, that he is. He's gonna crawl around on the floor. Let's make sure we're we're capturing full quality. There we go. Don't you hate it when your headset magically goes to half FPS? All right. Let's get into actual casting. That's one of the points I received on that survey was, uh, quote unquote, Dr. Oolong spaces out too much. He should do more casting in his casting. Uh, looks like <laughs> Spider-Man pretty low on health right now. Unfortunate, and actually not running the bunker, so. So much for, for crawling around on, uh, on the floor, web slinging. Actually, wait a minute, hold on a second there. Do I see no, more than three grenades? Three, Do I two, see? Let's one. see. Let's get confirmation. We've got a snowball, the normal hammer nade. Okay, no, I was I was just so mystified by the nades that I did see. Ooh, those two vector bullets hitting him from the back. Man, you can really just shoot the vector anywhere and have it hit your opponent, it seems. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, okay, those... I'm kind of surprised. Okay, that's a that's a new way of using the hammer nade. Kind of throwing it up into the upper right hand corner. I see that a lot on my 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 beam nades. Oh, Spider Man taking a lot of damage in that exchange there. Oh, the baby spine now taking a lot of damage. Oh, gets out of the way. I'm still torn up on on whether or not the avalanche nade is good. I I feel like it, it's it's great when it hits, but you could say that about almost any weapon. And it has the advantage of being able to go through shields, kind of, in that if they use the shield and they hold it, the, the beam cages will st still stick around. But if you only hit one or two of the bullets, you're not really going to do that much damage. Oh, and Spider-Man almost took the round, but Baby Spine's going to take the win. Good round game, buddy. Bam. <laughs> Bam.